You don't really know much about Halloween. And welcome to another unboxing with myself, Mr. Newly Dead. This is Newly Dead. It's behind the camera right there, just out of your sight. If you're not familiar with us, uh, check us out at thenewlydeads.com, or you can check out our TV show, our um, blog, our podcast, our YouTube channel, events where you can come see us, as well as eventually maybe a store with some of our art, and um, just more information about us. Sorry, my dog is right here, and he is chewing on his foot. So uh, anyway, this on this episode, we are going to talk about uh, something that I did that's a little insane this year, but uh, had a long talk with the missus and decided to go ahead and take the plunge. So I am now officially a subscriber at Vinegar Syndrome. Um, so fingers crossed, we'll see how that goes. I'm excited about it, but apprehensive, of course. Uh, so the first three films that released for the January uh, bundle for this year, are the ones we're going to talk about in this video. So um, the first one, and these are all um, blind buys, more or less, because I don't know any of these films. But I'm about to. Uh, the first thing we have is the horrible Dr. Hitchcock in 4K. Uh, this is the 1962 uh, Italian giallo, uh, not giallo, uh, Italian gothic horror film. Um, it's got some pretty dark subject matter, which uh, uh, if you're not familiar with, with it, I will leave the dark subject matter for you to figure out. Um, but uh, it's, it takes place in 1897 London. Um, where a woman weds a doctor who's got uh, rather perverse appetites. Um, his first wife died under mysterious circumstances and who might be returning from the grave to torment her herself. Um, so it is considered to be an, uh, a crucial kind of early work of the uh, Italian Gothic horror uh, canon. And I have heard a lot of good things about it. I've also heard some bad things about it, um, but it comes with this nice little booklet as well as I won't go through this too much because I don't know if there's any anything racy in there. I haven't actually looked through the booklet. Um, I don't want to get uh, in trouble with YouTube. But anyway, it's got a nice little booklet. If you like to do some reading on the films that you're watching, uh, it's got you know a nice little case within a case, which makes it even even double nice. So there's a lot of cardboard and a lot of new movie smell right here in one package. So um, this one is an interesting thing that I'm looking forward to watching. Next up. We've got Forgotten Gialli, Volume 6, which, if you know anything about me, if you've seen any of my other uh, reviews of movies, or if you've uh, talked with me about film in person, you will know that I am not a Giallo fan. Um, but as this comes as part of the set, um, we're going to give it another go. I've tried several Giallo movies, and so far I've not found any that really have struck a chord with me too much, other than maybe uh, New York Ripper, perhaps. But... Um, we're going to give it another try. I have a feeling I'm starting to get a little bit more into Italian horror films. Um, but this one includes three films that are considered, I guess, forgotten. Uh, we've got Death Carries a Cane. We've got Naked You Die, which uh, Giallo films typically involve uh, some kind of lewd subject matter, a killer with black gloves. And, uh, you know, you don't know who they are until the end is, is the, the typical expectation. Uh, and this is the Bloodstained Shadow, which this is the one I've heard the most about from this set. Um, I, I kind of was debating whether I should have bought the other ones that were uh, drastically cheaper um, during the sale so I could have almost the entire set, but I didn't because I wasn't willing to take that risk until I've had a chance to dig into this. So that one is on the list. And then the one I'm most excited about of the bunch is Santet 1 and 2. Now this is an Indonesian horror film uh, starring kind of the most famous horror queen, Susanna. Uh, this is from 1988 and 1989. Um, it is directed by Siswaro Gautama Putra. I'm hoping I'm not butchering that too much. Um, this one apparently has some very over-the-top gore, uh, slimy creatures, weird plot twists, and uh, there, of course there's musicals because that's what you want in your horror films. 
Um, this is a genre that I've been doing a lot of work in recently to try and kind of get myself more knowledgeable on it. Um, and I'm really enjoying the journey so far. Uh, it sounds like these are two pretty popular films, which I'd honestly not heard of before. And uh, from what I hear from my groups that I'm involved in and, and on Reddit and things is that uh, this is really good, both of them, and they're crazy. So this one is going to be a lot of fun. So look forward to more videos from me as each month there will be more subscriber releases coming out. There's not a release every single month, but there is almost, I think, all but two. So every time there's a new release, I'll get you a video, give you a little brief synopsis of what we got, and uh, we'll have a little fun. So I guess that's it for this one. I already gave you the information. And if you would like to go check out Vinegar Syndrome, go to vinegarsyndrome.com. Support them. Great boutique label. Nice people. Do great work. And we'll see you in the next one.